Alright guys, so just rolled into the field here on Mountain Farm playing more realistic. Haha, <laughs> got it out there. We got the other field done with the tandem plowing. I've dragged the subsider over here. Let's see how big this thing is. <laughs> this is a monster. It unfolds and then does it unfold again? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> Look at the size of that. <laughs> that is impressive. Right, uh, this might not work or might it work? Oh, so we're 7.8, wow. Uh, kill the offset, you fool. 80 degrees. Yeah, it's not lined up right at all. That's closer. That's a lot closer. I think that's how we're going to have to run this. I'd rather get it right or wrong. Okay, so... What are we doing here? Let's pop her in heavy duty. I think that's appropriate for dragging this. Six. Yes, get her down. Ooh, she's not liking that. Have we been beaten? Yeah, I think I've beat you, haven't I? Yeah, I'm not getting anything in it. <laughs> right then, so this implement is too big. Even for this tractor. This is a 400 brake tractor. She can't drag that. Well, that's not happening, is it? At all. Okay! That's what happens when you go too big. Slight problem then. It was working. So what's the crack with it? I'm not going to find it in there now. Uh, you in here? No? Yes, there you are. Yeah, it wanted 420. This is only a 400 tractor, I believe. I ain't going to find it in there. The reason I'm not going to find it in there is look at the size of that. Every tree that I placed, every bush that I placed was a placeable. It's completely written off. We've got the 410. We're only 10 shy. That must be a 420 minimum. Bugger. Just a slight problem. Okay, so. We're going to have to return this to the shop and see about picking up a new plow. Can I get out down there? Oh, let's just go back this way. That's a shame. That's cool. The whole reason was for buying this. But she's not going to run it. She's not going to run it. It's just too big. That should have stayed in there. Yeah, I'll keep it in high for now. Ah, bother. Well, we pushed too hard. Now I need to figure out what kind of uh, other implements we have. I don't think there is a subsoil that's in between. But there is a subsoil out there, isn't there? Really, that's all we get on heavy duty. Well, transport. Just ease the revs a little bit. The amount of running I've done on this verge now, it's good for about 9 mile an hour, 10 even. Be right. So, the subsoiling episode is now becoming a go to the shop episode. <laughs> I'll have to do a little bit of uh, money back. Because I've had this a couple of days now. It was, is it Seasons mod? It lets you. Uh, Get something, and if you return it sharpish, you don't lose any money. I think it's Caesar's above. I don't think I own a subsoil now. I'm sure I sent it back. Right, we need to put beacons on. Are we going to make it round? 
Beacons up. Beacons up. Good, good. I might as well turn this GPS off. I'm not going to be using that. Anything coming? No, nope, we're good. Let's think about MR. MR is not forgiving. If you don't have the power, you don't have the power. This is a bigger Great Reliance. It's the big bug pack. You're just going to have to wait. So we need to now find what I can get away with. The only other, what was this? This was a 7.8 meter subsoiler. The other one was a 4? Where do you even sell them? Uh, that looks promising. <laughs> cool. Scanning around the corner. There's another workshop there, look. Is that the one we need to be in? What's this one then? Sheep wool insulation. This is the sheep wool. Oh, well played. Well played. Yeah, that's the sheep wool. Oh, this is going to be awkward. Nice little cat. Now with a big tractor size, dinted it. I haven't made this easy, have they? Beat to the shop. Don't lose money, they say. <laughs> I do like the way it bounces, though, when you try to do quick reverses like this. That's cool. What the hell? <laughs> uh, well, we've definitely lost money on it now. Will it even fit? <laughs> <laughs> I guess there's an overhang. Yes, it will fit. She's in. Right, neutral, arm brake. Uh, get off. It's cool. How much is the thing actually worth? It's worth 82,000. Wow. How much are we going to get? 63. So I'm short 19. So GSC. Find it's button. Press tab. Put the money back. Thank you. Alright guys, so, I made an investment, we're now using one of the gym pack models, it's the medium one, not the largest one, I can't find a real life version of the largest one, but the largest one is also a bit to get around the place, so, ta da, <coughs> this will do nicely, <laughs> it's a big ass subsoiler, it's not as big as the Agrisem, but it will do, because the Agrisem was broken, I don't know whether this is a plus factor or not, but this one, it leaves the plough texture. It was released before the subsoilers were actually a thing with the Coon DLC, I believe. Well, I didn't right, did I? Why are you being so flicky? But at least we can see the textures changing. <laughs> and this is... I imagine you would see a texture change with this particular subsoiler. Some of them, they don't really mess the ground up, do they? they just sort of cut into it and uh, lift it. This one, it's got the roller on the back. That would leave sort of a cultivated effect. 
But there's lots more sort of close together teeth on this one. I don't know. I don't mind it. And we don't actually know the vehicle type for Subsoiler. I don't believe. I don't think it's in the list in the uh, SDK part. Minor problem. Right, up you come. Let's go to the middle of the yeah. She's really nippy with this. <laughs> but it, it's, the challenge of dragging this one is when you get it in the ground. That's in the weight of the thing. Uh, I don't think it's too much for a tractor of this size. But we are losing daylight fast. It's getting worse. This Times 5 is a killer. But it's going to be a shorter video this one, guys. I've had to do a lot of faffing around. Uh, this is the second subsonar I've tried after the Agrisem. We can work with this one. We can work with it. I can't believe how dark it's getting. Oh my god. One good thing I do like about Sweat is, uh, is everything lights up in the side. You've even got the lights on the dash look. We've got normal beam, front work lights, rear work lights. The shuttle light is pretty cool. I do like this tractor. <laughs> Does that work as well? Oh, yeah. Now it's got neutral though. How did I do to it? Ah, it's a slight delay for it to figure itself out. Ah, cool. Does it go neutral in reverse? No, it's only a forward that it goes neutral. <laughs> ah. I have had to admire this thing. But I think it's worked out quite well. Got a nice bit of drain on it. And it's not too hard to do, just copy it off. What did I copy it off? Uh, there's Dural Subsoil at the Cool Pack. I think I actually took the basic information from the Lemkin Dolomit that is on the database. Added it to it. Ta da! She's done. Side of the field is it's a big field too this one. But that is the whole point of buying the 400 brake tractor with the bigger equipment. We can get things done faster. And I do want to get the plow bonus in. I was up and hour at first, but I'm trying to make my decision now. I've committed to it. So this is where we're at. Just me, the lights a little bit. Close on this. You know? It's not quite bright enough out there. Yeah, right a problem. Wait, did, 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 did. forwardly directions like you do. She just dig in well. I mean how much are we using it? Undefined input in gearbox mode, okay? Three ninety. That's better. So we got about eighty to play with. So I'll show it a hill, and it might freak out. I don't think I have to brought that up on the edge, so did I? Ah, should have done. Let's see what she was actually at. Watch, because she's capable of pulling out. Her. Right, the darkness is setting in, we are in a world of pain. I, it's, the way the season is supposed to work is I believe tonight is a growth cycle. So as soon as we hit midnight, everything's going to grow or not, is the case of the week's going to be, because that's going to the bloody crowd. Yeah, the wheat won't grow because it's still in the back of the cedar. Crap. I might see if Pete fancies some over time. 
<laughs> One of us are going to do it. If I'm in this, I can't do it. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not that good. <laughs> do this. I might see if Pink wants to run this. I believe we've pretty much got to the bottom part done, so I could send him on an up and down run now. Oh well. Alright guys, we're going to call it there, I'll be back tomorrow and I will let you know how the CD went. There may be a short episode in between and the fun will continue. Yeah. Alright guys, I'm going to call it there. And we shall be back on Thursday and either me or Pete is going to be on with the scene. We will find out just how close we get to finishing this. Feel lovely. Okay. I think that's definitely the plan though. We're going to have to uh, call him back in. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, I think I'll put him on this actually because this is not trailed. <laughs> It'll be easy for him to figure out with a bit of luck. Uh, where's my buttons? Button, button, who's got the button? There we go. So, we're going to take the fast track out with the Vader staff. Just to make life a bit easier. And we'll see how we get on. These lights are really close, aren't they? They need adjusted. Yeah, I'll put Pete in this. <laughs> right, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you next time. Later.